What's up guys, in today's video, we're gonna be showing you guys how to pull off your grill on your 2019 Silverado. Really simple to do. So first, what we gotta do is open the hood. If you don't know how to do that, you should probably stop watching the video because I did not even look to see if that was gonna hit my garage door opener. Good thing it didn't. All right, so you got your hood open. The grill is real simple, it comes off. You almost don't even have to have any tools. There's just a few tools you need. But first thing we're gonna do, you're gonna want a flathead screwdriver. And you're gonna see these right here. They're all around the top of your grill. Can't remember how many they are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten of them. You're gonna need a flathead screwdriver. You're gonna pry up on these. I'll show you how to do that real quick. All right, so take your flathead screwdriver, push, twist, go around to the side, twist. Once you get it popped up, pull up the top part and then once you pull up the top part you can pretty much just oh nope, not like that get your flathead underneath the whole thing and you can pop it right out just like that real simple all right once we get all 10 of those out the next thing we're gonna do before we can remove this top piece of your grill is we're gonna pull off our hood latch and to do that you're gonna need a t15 torque screwdriver I've already pulled one of them off And then this thing just basically pulls right out just like that so as you can see we've got the full uh, shield off or pan or whatever you guys want to call it right there on the floor we've got our handle off for the hood latch and now we're left with this open cavity behind the grill and what's left is just pulling off a few 10 millimeter bolts and then we can pull the grill out so these bolts that are left you're gonna see there's one right here right here right here and right here those are the four bolts that you have to remove 10 millimeter socket will do it just fine or a wrench and then once that's done this grill here will basically just pull out you're going to want to get a good grip right here both hands top and bottom give it a tug a real fast tug and it should pop off and then there's a few clips right here 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 and here there's a clip down in the bottom here clip on the other side clip 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 and then I think there's a clip up top here on both sides. But most of those clips will release as soon as you give it that good pull. And uh, once you do that, just make sure to not put too much stress on this part because it'll start pulling and it, you could actually break this part of the grill. So just be real gentle with it. There's two white clips on the top, two on the bottom on both sides, and your grill should come out. So let's do that now. So there you have it guys, reassembly is basically the opposite of taking it apart. You're gonna snap your grill back in, feed it through the bottom first, and then roll it up and stand it up. Make sure on these edges here, when you're putting it back together, there's two white clips and two white clips that they go into the receivers that they belong in because sometimes when you snap in the middle of the grill first, the outside wants to be bowed a little bit and just doesn't line up. So that's it, snap the grill back in, put your four 10 millimeter bolts back across the top, lay your splash shield back in, put those clips back in and put your hood latch back on, good to go. All right, I appreciate you guys watching the video. Be sure and like and subscribe if you haven't already. Check out my other videos. I've got plenty of build videos on this truck. 2019 Silverado, as you can see, we got it wrapped. We got wheels, tires, lowering. We got some lights going on, all kinds of cool stuff. So subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video.